Uh, so let's move on now. And by moving on, I need to do something. So give me a second. Okay. Bella! Thank you, Bella. Um, now, I called my daughter Isabella in here yeah. because she is going to help me play this exciting new game that I invented, a game for the whole family, a game I like to call Trumping. Trumping. Okay. It's a fun ad-libbing game. Yeah, I get to sit in this chair. So it's really on topic with the ad-libbing that I did to try and end the last bit, where... Uh -huh. Someone calls out a topic, any topic about anything at all, and you need to talk about that subject, whatever it is, as if you were Donald Trump. Okay. Now, here's the key facts to Trump, and here's, here's basically the only two rules to help you play. Someone calls out, someone calls out a subject, a topic, and anything, and you have to talk about it as if you were Donald Trump. Here are the two Do we rules. have to do the nope. voice? No, but something okay. it helps. It okay. helps. Okay. Now, now here are the two main rules to trumping. Number one, no matter what anyone calls out, you are the best at it. Yes. Sorry. Doesn't matter what the person says, you are the best at it. Yes. Number one. <laughs> Number two, you act like you know the subject even when you know nothing about the subject. They, yes. If anything, that 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 makes it even more Trumpishness. Yes. So Bella, why don't you call out a few topics? Just um, just come up with some off the top of your head. Uh, uh, football. Football. Okay. I've played football when I was younger. Some people called me the best. Not me. Other people called me the best. Football uh -huh. player. I know everything about football. I know about the running and the kicking and the touchdowns and the 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 goals. I made so many goals yeah. in football <laughs> when I was younger. In fact, I could have gone pro. Mm -hmm. But instead I said I I'm just going to keep banging immigrant women. <laughs> so, that that was gonna be my goal. But still I'm I'm a very svelte very svelte yeah. football player and they don't have football in China. They don't have football in China, but if they did, the Chinese in China would yeah. be looking to me because I am a great football player. I had 38 triple doubles in one quarter. And if you know football, like I know football, you know that that's impressive. Okay, so I, I just trumped I just trumped football. Okay. Bella, give me another. Give me another subject. Give me another subject. Pokemon. Pokemon. I've caught them all. I've caught all five thousand eight hundred and thirty-four Pokemon. Crooked Hillary Clinton. She hired immigrants to catch Pokemon for her. I would never <laughs> do that. That's why we need to build a wall around the Pokemon. Yeah. I caught all the legendaries. I, I, I caught uh, 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 Luciendo. Yeah. I caught um, Voltrape. I caught uh, Skidderidoo. I caught four Skidderidoos. I caught four <laughs> Skidderidoos. You don't know how hard it is to catch a Skidderidoo. Not many people even know about Skidderidoos, but I do because I'm, I, I'm a Pokemon <laughs> master. When people say, I want to be the very best, originally the lines were, I want to be the, bear, the very best, just like me, Donald Trump. Those are the original lines of Pokemon. Yes. Go back into your history books. You'll see it. So, so everybody's Donald Trump. Immigrants come to this country and they steal people's Pokeballs. They bring in Poke violence and Poke crime. That's why we need to Poke get rid of all the Poke immigrants. Yeah. It just trumped Pokemon. That was a good one. That was a good one. Give me another subject. Give me another subject. Uh, Any subject. Five Nights at Freddy's. Five Nights at Freddy's. I've lasted 12 nights. No other <laughs> I've lasted 12 nights at Freddy's. In fact, in fact, in fact, Freddy, 
uh, uh, Fuzzy Bear, he came into the room and he tried to scare me. But then he saw who I was and he was like, wow, I can't scare you. You're probably the greatest man in the world. Yeah. And then he left and killed himself because that's how amazing I am. Mm-hmm. In fact, the entire game was based on me. I used to work at a pizza place and the robots came to life and then I scared <laughs> them by masculinity. And then they ran away screaming, crying to their mother about how amazing I am. <laughs> Why are you wearing a Jewish necklace? Was that Nana's? Yeah. That was Nana's? Okay. Why did Nana have a Jewish necklace? I don't know. I'm just obsessed with this. <laughs> okay. It's a really it's really pretty, but I'm just not sure why she why had she it. Have... Why did Nana have a Jewish necklace? Honey, why did Nana have a Jewish necklace? Maybe she was a closet Jew. Okay. She was a closet Jew. Like Maxwell. Maxwell. Marvel. Marvel? Marvel? Marvel movies are horrible. DC is so much better. Batman v Superman should have won an Oscar for Best Picture, Best Foreign Picture, Best Documentary, Best Animated Short Subject. The entire movie should have won Best Song because that film was just a beautiful song. That film was like a million American Pies Greatest movie of all time. I'm not just saying that because one of my cabinet members, Steve Mnuchin, made the film. I'm just saying, if you put Iron Man and you put Batman v Superman, it's obvious that Batman v Superman makes everyone cry and is the greatest film in the world. Everybody believes that. If you saw one bad review anywhere, it's from the evil media, the evil liberal media who is out to hate good people like Steve Mnuchin. <laughs> Fake news. Anyone who says they hate Batman v Superman is fake news. The real story is, how come all of the liberals pretend like they like Marvel movies? DC movies are amazing. Suicide Squad, that made me cry. Greatest of all time. Maxwell, you want to give me a topic for trumping? Okay, give me a topic, Maxwell. Uh, I do. Uh, but I am going to have... I'm in person... Superman. Iron Man versus Superman. Okay, let me talk to you about Superman. Superman is an immigrant. He is an alien from a foreign land, and we need to get rid of him. Iron Man is a billionaire industrialist who used to sell weapons to foreign countries. Iron Man is a wonderful person, and Superman is an evil foreign immigrant who came here bringing crime. He destroyed Metropolis. Him and his evil immigrant buddy destroyed Metropolis. So obviously Iron Man would win. Superman hates Jesus. <laughs> you have a topic for Trumping? Okay, give me a give me a topic for Trumping. Immigrant trying to trick you. Working. <laughs> okay, I know more about immigrants than any other person. Because I came from a foreign land called New York City, <laughs> and I immigrated to Washington, D.C., and I made a better end. So in a way, I'm an, Im- I'm an immigrant. I'm the best immigrant. I'm better, I'm better at immigranting than all of these <laughs> other so-called immigrants. If you heard anything other than that, it's fake news. I started using fake news at story time. At first, yeah. I was uncomfortable with it, but now I've just gotten used to it. If the kids say something I don't like, I just <laughs> fake news, fake news. <laughs> Fake news, fake news, your kids are fake news. Um, Everything I disagree with is fake, fake news. news. Sometimes my wife, fake, fake news. news. See, I'm thinking, see, okay, see, I'm, I'm, I'm going to critique your Trump if you don't mind. That's fine. Okay. I'm trying not to do a Trump impression. It's just when you're Trumping, you just get into the zone, but I'm trying not right. to do an impression. Well, not for the voice, but I, I think you meet, you need more build up to the best okay you know okay um so so much more um oh god that fucking saturday night live guy john lovitz john lovitz john oh uh yeah john lovitz okay yeah, give it a little more John Lovitz because John Lovitz would start slow and then build his way up from there. Like, like, um, 
next one. I worked in a grocery store. I was a box boy. I was the manager of the box boys. I I oh, was okay. the manager yeah, of the store. Right. Not so just, so not and, not and Trump does. He leads up to the best. It, it's like it's like um, Pokemon. I, I know Pokemon. I, I like Pokemon. I'm I'm good at Pokemon. I'm the best at Pokemon. You know, I think yeah, you need okay. more run up to the best. Yeah. Okay. But now in the first one where you, where you said with the best, you did really, yeah, you did really something really good there. Cause that is very Trump esque is that whatever you're saying, you've got to give yourself plausible deniability. Yeah. Okay. So you had said, I'm the best. I played in a school in football. I'm the best. No. Other people tell me that. I don't say that. This was your chance. But other yes. people say that. You know, like Star Lord. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Other people say that about me. You know, that, you know, Trump always gives himself plausible deniability by, by, Saying he's not saying what he's saying. Uh, right. I was just wondering if we needed more. Oh no, I can't drink. Oh, okay. What can't you drink? Because I have to wake up at six o'clock in the morning. I mean, well, I, well I thought I thought it was Will getting it was, I, I thought it might be getting canceled or moved back or something. Is that still happening? No, no, no. I don't want that because you're Okay. Okay, but now we've already kind of stopped a little bit. So, like, what's okay. going on? Uh, I have to wake up early Still? so that I can leave at six thirty. No, no, no. The hospital okay. by seven thirty. Okay, so so it's still going on. Yes. Okay. Because the fucking insurance company told us all kinds of different things. Yeah. First, we were denied. Then it was pending the authorization for our pre, whatever. And then when I called, they were like, "Oh, we need to talk to the doctor." So the nurse called, and the nurse was told that. It was set on urgent status to call back towards the end of the day. And then she called back and they said, oh, well, there's no pre-authorization required. It's recommended or no, encouraged, but it's not fucking required. Okay, gotcha. See, I, I, like, I am thinking, and I'm sorry, Tasha, I'm changing the subject a little, but I am thinking since Tasha is there and Destiny is going to be there, and Deanna's going to be there. I, I think we owe it to trash your family. Trash my family? Yeah. I'm down. <laughs> which family? My brother? The ones that are... Oh, the bad the ones. dicks in your family. Like, which family? I'm, 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 I'm really upset with my brother for not calling me when he put the dog down yesterday. But whatever. Yeah. Ooh, really? Oh, That's God, I didn't I know that. Oh, oh, way to bring us down. I'm so sorry. Oh, no, it's okay. But we'll wait for everybody to be there. Okay, okay. well. I, I'm really not feeling it anymore because it's just not worth my time. Yeah. Well, I'm if, feeling it. Then you go for it, Bunny, because you're I'm, fucking awesome. And every reply that you ever oh, yeah. posted on all that shit, I was like, fuck yeah. yeah I'm you not, go, Bunny. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I. Uh, it was weird to see so many uh, various. I, it was weird to see so many walls being being <laughs> torn down. down, but I literally heard Lauren like three or four times tell me, so this Bunny guy, he's the guy who does, you do the podcast with? Oh my God, tell Bunny that I love him. <laughs> tell Bunny I love him. Well, Bunny's, Bunny's more our family than that side of the family. And yeah. she was like, well, I mean, I don't know him. I was like, well, I don't technically know him. I've never met him. But we talked to him way more than we ever talked to anybody in that family. Yeah. yeah. So, off that yeah. family, him, more, and more than I talked to my parents. So. Right? Yeah. Well it, well, it was fun and challenging to mock and attack people that I completely don't know yes. on a subject yeah. that really shouldn't be any of my business. But, like, I, yeah. I, I felt I was, I was given permission. So, I was like, you know, that's all I need to hear. <laughs> you know? Yeah. And I was very disappointed at first because, like, I woke up the next day and, like, that's the first thing I went to check. Because I was hoping, I was hoping the guy who started it, um, would have replied to stuff. Yeah, 
and then his daughter did instead. And she called me out by name, and I looked at that, and I was like, oh, that was a mistake. (laughs) Yeah, you're just calling down the rain of thunder right here is what you're doing. Why? Okay. Look. If I call somebody a cunt rag. Yes. You don't need to tell me that that's offensive. I know it's offensive. That's why I said it. <laughs> right. Amber, Amber, try and bring it down a little bit if you can, just a little bit. What are you talking about, Amber? Being loud? Okay. Sorry. Gotcha. Oh, and 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 and. Funny, funny. Yeah. Funny, I love you. <laughs> who's who's okay, that? Like that? Like, funny, yeah. yeah. Like, I yeah. Yeah. Everybody loves you. Everybody loves you. Well, because well, first off, first off, I read through his whole post, you know, before actually getting started, because I kind of wanted to know what the fight was, you know. And then after having read it, I was like, okay, I'm in. You're a selfish cop. Yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I mean, my like, face. what the fuck is wrong with you? My favorite, my favorite was, uh, 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 my sister died. How can I make this all about me? That yeah, was classic, yeah, right? yeah. That was that was freaking amazing. Well, because that's what I was I was hearing through the whole first part of the post. Yeah, it was like, well, I I asked to see see her here, and I asked to see her here, and I asked to see her. Okay, you know what you're being? You're being a big pain in the ass at the wrong fucking time. Yeah, you know, and you know, number one, I'm sure it wasn't like that. Okay, right off the bat, yeah. I, I'm sure it wasn't like that. But even if it fucking was. You know, even if Tasha just took an attitude like, you know what, fuck him. He's not seeing her because I don't need somebody up my ass right now. That would yeah. be valid, too. Yeah. This is, this, somebody's funeral, somebody's mother's funeral is not the place to be starting fucking drama. Oh my god, there's an argument going on about uh, my daughter Emerald and her quote unquote cuddle buddy. Yeah. Uh, my my daughter has a cuddle buddy. Yeah. Bunny. Yeah. Yeah. A cuddle buddy. It's a it's a guy who comes over to the house to cuddle with my daughter. Really? Yeah, and they cuddle, and and that's what they do. That that's apparently a thing. That's nice. Yeah, sure. I guess Dude, it's like puppies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just 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 a cuddle, buddy. And then and then and then I keep saying like, oh, Emerald, is your is your boyfriend coming over? And Emerald says, no, I don't have a boyfriend. And I'm like, oh yeah, you don't have a boyfriend. You just have a member of the opposite sex that you are on top of and fawn over. No, I'm trying to record a podcast. What happened? I made Jake turn red. Okay, why? Amber made, Amber's like, Mom, smell him. And I was like, oh. No. <laughs> okay. Don't make me do that again. It was really uncomfortable. Right. I shouldn't be sniffing miners. It's gross. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, 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 dude. Did you ever see sniffing miners live? Because you, you, You're not like a real fan of sniffing miners <laughs> until you've yeah. seen them live. They do an amazing live show. That's what I'm saying. Big fan of sniffing miners. Yeah. Um, um, I, I'm more familiar with the, uh, sniffing miners. Um, the, the German expression is silent film. Oh yes. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. Where, where, where they were, they had dogs sniffing, um, coal miners. Yeah. 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 I've seen the original, I've seen the original German film back when it was just called Das Miner Sniffing. Yes. Um, since we're just kind of riffing here and there's a little chaos going on. 
I'm going to yes, talk to Jeannie for a second, and I'm just not going to clip it's... it out, but I want her on the mic. Okay. Only yeah. our loyal fans that will listen to a four-hour, five-hour fucking show, yep. they get to hear this, okay? Yes, yes. Nobody else. Rick, yeah. I just sat so, down. Honey, if anything, let this me, is an Easter. Let me start with, I think the car is okay. Oh, God. Yeah. It was, it was overheating a lot. It was overheating. Um, I don't need this. And I just got home. Yeah. Um. And I finally found found the um. Well, f- first I stopped for the pot. Okay. Okay. On the way back. Okay. Uh, I'm giving it a, a a memento narrative. <laughs> okay. Starting at the end. But I'm I'm slightly panicked. Okay. okay. No, don't panic. Um. So it was overheating. It was smoking and everything. What? So it was overheating and smoking. No. Um, let me finish. I, I am letting you finish. I didn't okay. say anything. Okay. I'm just reacting to um, what you said, and I think that's valid. That so was a valid I got, reaction. I I I, I um got home. Yeah. So I got home, I waited for it to cool down for a bit, and then I went out and I checked it, and I finally found where the water actually goes. Okay. Okay. So I put water in it. Okay. And there is a water leak on, like, a hose or something, but I'm pretty sure, like, most of the water went in. So it wasn't actually smoke, it was steam? Is that what you're saying? Yeah. <sighs> yeah, I believe that's the correct term for it. I'm sorry. So we got a leak somewhere. Oh, and you, you could see where the leak is, but it's... it's so it a, needs a new hose. Or something that's really hard to see in there. Hello, Royal, the Pope. A on hose the or a clamp or something like that. Go ahead. Look, this Easter... Oh no! I'm just talking about this is an Easter egg, so I'm yes. putting mm-hmm. a, a, a special hidden message for the fans. As you guys keep talking, so keep that's talking. A, that's a I'll good idea. But, uh, yeah. So I stopped. So, for, so I stopped for the pot. Finding this Easter, and that's where I saw it was smoking. The only steaming. way you could hear it steaming. Was steaming. Okay. So if you listen to the something entire episode. And you are different and more expensive. That makes you a true Pope on And the money had to transfer it, so I had to leave. In related news, I live in a crazy so, house going insane. I came home. I took care of the car. Okay. okay. And then, nice um, okay, and you're not a ghost. Then I was like, I got four bucks in my wallet. Um, How many people are in my house right now? I so. stole a dollar out of the laundry money. Seven, eight, nine, and and I went back because I wanted to test the car, you know, as okay. well. Mm-hmm. Okay, stop so it. I Remember? went back and I okay. just bought a joint. Wanna, so that's that's it right now. Okay, but we got a joint. Yeah, this is good. Um, but they're not going to give us the food stamps. Did you? Okay, we're going to bring it. But but if I don't say it now, you're gonna go to bed. I know, I know. Yeah. And I I didn't want all of this to just wait till tomorrow. And I turned it into an Easter egg, so this is a pretty big deal now. We're we're having a lot of problems lately, so things are things are really bad. This has just really upset Jeannie. Yeah. I'm sorry. Don't don't tell Natasha that you guys are having problems because she'll immediately follow that up with, "Oh, really? My mom's dead." Yeah. Yeah. Well, my mom's dead too, and so is Benny. So we're all our moms are dead. Yeah. Yeah. But she she really hits you hard with that. Yeah. She's like, "I'm going to make this death awkward." I'm going to wait for you guys to move so fast. So, yeah. Hi, Diana. Hello. Hey, Deanna, 
Uh, this week we're doing a pretty interesting movie. You know Crispin Glover? You know who that is? Yes. He played the dad in Back to the Future. Yeah, he wrote, produced, directed, edited, and starred in his own movie. Jesus. Uh, I think you might be interested in it. Have you ever wanted to see two Down Syndrome people having sex in a cemetery? That sounds like something I would want to see. Because if so, this movie is up your alley. Wait, if you wait. ever want to see you know, for a two Down Syndrome... I thought you were going to say it's Yes. No, it's not up your ass. Is it MacGruber? No, it's not MacGruber. It's not MacGruber. It's not MacGruber. Good job, but no, it's not MacGruber. It's very similar all of us. If, if you ever wanted to see a naked old... If you ever wanted to see a naked old Down Syndrome man getting a hand job from a naked big-breasted woman wearing a monkey outfit while they're in an oyster... And Crispin Glover, who is dressed like a Nazi, looks on while a racist country song plays in the background. Then this movie is definitely for you. And also, you're weird. If that is what you've been looking for in films, then that's really weird. Yeah, then that's really weird. Yeah. But, oh no, Destiny held her a little bit to because of a cat video. So, you guys doing okay? You guys doing all right? She's I'm worried. really upset and stormed out of the room. Okay. Is she upset at me? Is she upset? No. She's no? upset at everything that happened. Cause we're, we're a step away from being homeless. Oh, God. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It, it, do you, do you want to, like, a, like, a, do the podcast later? Do you yeah. want to... Now, Take a break or something. John, John. You know, and all week I've been trying to get us on food stamps, which with my agoraphobia and anxiety and everything, it's really fucking hard to do. Yeah. You know, being driving around and, you know, and I broke down and cried in the fucking office while doing it, you know? Yeah. Um, and when we're not going to get them, because at twenty thousand dollars a year, Genie is making too much money. Yeah. Like what the fuck? Yeah. Maxwell, stop growling. Okay, everything is fine. Take a deep breath. Take a chill pill. Write a write a haiku. You're fine. I imagine Maxwell would write good haikus. Yeah. Man, everybody's having just a hard time now, right yeah. now, at this moment. Everybody's having a really difficult time yeah. with everything. Hey, you okay? I'm sorry, buddy. Okay. No, nah, that's okay. Let's get back to being funny. Okay. And then um, she's, she's upset with me because I was saying it upbeat. You know, well, I'm doing a show. I've got to tell you this, you know. You, yeah. will, you will go to bed in the middle of the show. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Well, in that case, we'll move on to the next segment because this one I, I'm, I'm really proud of because I, I, I think I wrote it really well. And I think it's really, I th- honestly think it's really funny. So, okay. 